the states from hands in the dirt and uh we're gonna put a plum tree in the ground this is a au uh, rosa plum which stands for auburn university they cultivated this plum tree and uh you know i don't give auburn university much credit for nothing being a georgia bulldog fan but i got to give them some credit for this uh beautiful plum tree so shout out to those tigers only one time. All right, let's get into it. We'll have to make it wide and deep. Okay, we're once back. I get it dug, I'll come back. So we're about ready to put the tree in the ground. And the way I measure to know how deep I need to go is I put my whatever I'm digging with next to the plant and you see that's about a shovel blade high and so when I go in my hole I try to go about shovel blade high so I had to back fill this a little bit because you don't want to get you don't want to bury this too deep I'm going to take my plant just like that. All right. So I uh, went and got some string so I can tie this up. Make sure this plant, to make sure this tree stays straight. Yep, that looks fairly straight. I'll take this. Like I said, this is a pool noodle. I just split it. Put it around the base of the tree. Try to keep critters and stuff from gnawing at it. All right. And I'll just backfill it.
Then I'm going to water it in. All right, so there we have it. AU Rosa Plum Tree planted in the ground. So um, I'm gonna let it settle. I watered it in, let it settle down, and then I'll fertilize it later. Um, let the tree get accustomed and uh, used to being in the ground. Uh, and then I'll come back and hit it with the good fertilizer. All right. States from hands in dirt, and remember, if you have some seeds, put them in the dirt.